Fast-moving developments tonight in the battle to keep NBA basketball in Seattle. New emails reveal what the Oklahoma City owners of the Sonics were really thinking about keeping the team in Seattle. Plus, Sonics fans confront Governor Gregoire and get a glimmer of hope. Cairo 7's Essex Porter is live with the latest from South Seattle. Essex? And Chris, we still need to emphasize there is no plan from Seattle to take to the Board of Governors next week and fight to keep NBA basketball in Seattle. And it turns out that while Sonics fans did confront the governor, they did come away with a little bit of cautious optimism. Sonics fans gathered to greet the governor at the last stop of her four-day re-election tour around the state and demanded her help. If she's not going to do it, that we have to let her know that, that we'll do what we can. There'll be political consequences. This comes as the city of Seattle is getting new ammunition in its lawsuit to keep the Sonics at Key Arena until 2010. Newly released emails indicate that team owner Clay Bennett may have lied to NBA Commissioner David Stern. Last summer, Bennett wrote Stern that he and partner Aubrey McClendon had never discussed moving the Sonics from Seattle. That's what Clay Bennett was telling Commissioner Stern in August, but four months earlier in April, this email shows that he was telling his partners he's a man possessed to get the Sonics out of Seattle. One co-owner asking if there's a way to move here, Oklahoma, for the next season, or are they doomed to have another lame duck season? Bennett answering, I'm a man possessed, and saying, thanks for hanging in there with me, boys. That's at the same time he was telling everyone else that he was working to stay in Seattle. Essex, I think we were all lied to. I am shocked. Um, I'm about as frustrated as I could be. Save Our Sonics leaders had a private meeting with the governor and say she promised to pursue one of their ideas for an arena plan. We think we may have come up with an idea that she was unaware of, that she thinks is viable. We're going to hold her to her promise to explore it. And we'll see what happens, but we're, we're happy with her commitment. We're going to judge her by her actions. Now, no one wanted to talk about any sort of details of what the governor is working on, but apparently it involves assuring the city of Seattle that if it goes forward and puts up more money for an arena plan, that the state will cover the city when the legislature meets next year. Now, there's a big stack of these emails that are making news tonight. We've put them all on our website, CairoTV.com. Reporting live in South Seattle, Essex Porter, Cairo 7, Eyewitness News.